it's hard to stay focused because now in the draft year everything is yeah everyone is talking about the draft but I try to focus and now we have the the goal to reach the playoffs and that's now the my biggest goal to reach uh, unfortunately they talk a lot about my injuries yeah and then yeah they talk about what I'm good at what I wanted to improve and yeah stuff like this if, if I'm good playing in the team team player character to get something personal about me yeah that's what they're t talking about that I work I work hard like outside of the ice like when other go from the ice may stay a little bit longer work on a shot work on skating or even if we we have a day off go on the gym or even when I'm at home I I can push myself to do something and work other than other players too and that's something that brought me that far because I now was one of the best players so I always had to work hard to reach my goals and I continue to work hard to reach my goals in the future too. Conrad had, uh, he had an excellent start, he came in here probably our best conditioned athlete. Um, obviously he uh, was injured three times this year which, which slowed him down a bit but uh, you know he had a very good season, he finished strong. He's a defensive defenseman with an offensive flair to his game. So, you know, you talk to most of the NHL scouts, uh, they look at him as being more of a steady Eddie, uh, puck moving defenseman. He has to get a little more physical. He's a big guy, but, uh, you know, when you're that size, you kind of have to use it to your advantage. So, I think once he learns how to play a little more physical, he's going to be a heck of an all around defenseman. The NHL scouts project him as a defensive defenseman that moves the puck well. Uh, for me, I think he'll definitely be all that, but I think he can also add an offensive side to his game. Uh, yeah, we used him on the power play as a 17-year-old, and uh, I think his vision is great, his passing is excellent, so I think he'll be a defensive defenseman, but uh, you know, he, he does have that offensive upside that uh, is going to surprise a lot of people.